Good evening and welcome to tonight's programme with me, Assad Ahmed. BBC London has learned that the Metropolitan Police, who are responsible for processing criminal record checks, are taking so long to do them that some Londoners end up losing their offers of a job. Well, the checks are needed for anyone working with children or vulnerable adults. And although they're supposed to take anything up to two months to complete, in about half of all cases, that target is simply missed. Josephine McDermott has been speaking to a nurse in South London who suffered because of the delays. And I guess I should start with my uniform, which is slightly different to the nurse's outfit. Julie Stennett is a qualified nurse. Now she's a painter and decorator. You've got to sort of carry little bits in here. Like she was offered a nursing job in September last year. The criminal background check she needed, known as a DBS check from the Disclosure and Barring Service, should have been a formality taking less than two months. Instead, it took nearly a year, in which time the job offer had been withdrawn. While the mother of two was waiting, she had to claim job seekers' allowance and fell into rent arrears. Should I forget about the bills and pay the rent or should I, uh, and, and, and buy food or should I just, you know, give, give a little bit to everybody and, and do without food? Um, so what would you do? We used to go to a food bank in Peckham. In the end, she was forced to take work painting and decorating. I was so angry and so upset with the fact that these people had just ignored everything that I said to them. A DBS check is vital if you work with children or vulnerable adults. But at the moment, there are more than 50,000 people waiting for their applications to be processed by the Met. In about half of cases, it's taking more than two months. So Julie's not alone. Walk upstairs and there's her neighbour, Ola, a care worker. Hello, my she too spent months waiting for her DBS check to come through. Not being able to work for eight months is devastating. The delays have had an impact on all forms of employment, from taxi drivers to social workers, teachers and elderly carers. One of our local um, home care agencies in Richmond Borough, a small company providing support to people in their own homes, currently have 37 new recruits waiting for their DBS clearance. Uh, that has a significant impact on their capacity and ability then to support people in their own homes. The Disclosure and Barring Service said it would not compromise on issues of safeguarding, but it said the current delays were of great concern. The Met says the delays are down to a shortage in staff and also a surge in the number of private hire licences being applied for. They say they've now brought in more people and the backlog is down from 83,000 in April. But today, nobody from the Met or the Home Office would agree to speak to us. Josephine McDermott, BBC London News. Well, that's our top story this evening, but this is what's still to come before the end of the programme.